I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing, and it shows in the technique because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight. But there aren't that many guys. You ready? You ready? All right, let's get this one started here. Round one is underway. And we've got a striker who is a force to be reckoned with. I thought he draws a guy who can do a little bit of everything. And that guy is usually the one that will have the advantage. But we know what a high-level striker is. And this guy is as high-level as we've ever seen in the UFC. And a nice jab there, champ. The jab was a lost art in mixed martial arts. Guys have found it, and they are fighting behind it real well. That jab is fast. Look at that jab. Big punch land through the middle. Ooh, looking to set up the head kick, but he misses. As he gets close and he's out of the kicking range, he'll, suddenly, he'll change his stance. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the gentleman. Big head kick lands. Couple of chins here being tested early. Great punch. Oh, Superman punch! Connects with a right hand, pretty good punch, that one. Nice right punch by this young man. Beautiful kick. Down south. Right hand on point. Oh, body kick attempt here, it's no good. Well, he continues to find the openings tonight. Beautiful connection with the punch there. Accuracy at its best. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Lee gets touched by that leg kick attempt. Shove, shove. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Oh, and there's a land with the kick, so certainly a good sign for him there. When that's working, you know he's in for a good night. Oh, he's wearing it now, bleeding from his cheek. Nice punch by Lee. Just misses with the right. Oh, nice counter jab there. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. And there comes the separation now. Right punch is good. The left also flush. Ooh, head kick lands and he's hurt. And he landed the right hand there. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. Oh, an educated jab there. I could watch this dude jab all day. I mean, he's so light on his feet, and when he pops that jab, it comes right back to his face. Straight right hand now just misses. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Look at how he turned his hip into that leg kick. One, two punch by Lee. Just misses with a left hook there. Uppercut is blocked. Looked like for a minute he had a window there. It closed quickly. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Oh, and he can 
connects with a punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton. And to watch his punch like this puts a smile on my face. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Big body kick. Nice sneaky head kick. Another shot lands upstairs. Punch over the top. Oh, he lands a hook there, DC. That was one of his more significant lands of the fight. He can land that strike over and over again. Round two next. All right, let's check out some of the action now from that previous round, and he really kept finding a home for those kicks. Yeah, and why would you change it? If your opponent is not going to check, if he's going to stand there, and he's not on his toes, and he's stationary, you keep driving those kicks into his thighs, into his body, until he makes some sort of adjustment. All right, here we go as our next round gets Ready? underway. His Ready? strong leg packs so much power that even when he doesn't throw it full throttle, you see he's able to inflict damage. We'll see if he can keep it going here in this He round. doesn't throw it full power, but even when he faints it, he draws out reactions from his opponents because they don't want to get hit with any more of those kicks. It's a sight to behold. Tried to set up the straight left, but he missed. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Oh, and he connects there. Pretty nice punch there. Great job finding the range to land those punches. And both guys really throwing with authority. The one-two punch is true. Pretty good jab there by Lee. Oh man, his leg kicks are outstanding and you saw a great example of that just there. And you see as the punch starts to slow down, you cannot take many of those kicks. The issue with that kick, as effective as it is, one gets checked got the Anderson Silva situation. Oh, and he connects there. His hands look good to me. So fast, I mean, this guy has tremendous hand speed. He landed that kick to the outside of the lead leg there, DC. He is chopping up that leg. They say chop down the tree. You beat your opponent by slowing him down first with those nice outside leg kicks. Ooh, what a head kick. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, lands another shot to the body, beautifully placed as he continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. Oh, man, that cut is getting worse. Absolutely nasty. Big, powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. He gets tagged by that straight punch. Nice land for the offense there. Oh, that's a hell of a kick right there. He told us Thursday that he was going to be kick heavy tonight, and that is certainly a step in the right direction. He is landing that strike very effective with it. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round, no denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. Good series of punches by him there. He has certainly had no trouble finding the range tonight. He is finding the target with everything he throws. He's mixing it up beautifully. Oh, man. This is one thing you, you do not want to get kicked in the head at MMA. You cannot take too many of those head kicks, but this guy gets his leg up there so fast, sometimes you don't see it come. Oh, big head kick land. Big kick. Throwing that jab, no good. Good stick.
Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to his pullage. He throws his jab. He may float a right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's got to be confident that it's going to land, and he's got to really throw his whole entire body into those strikes. Well, he's got the kicking game going tonight. Lands another one there. A beautiful kick, and all I can think of, better him than me. Take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Beautiful punch. Back and forth we go. Oh, huge strike lands there, and somehow his opponent's chin held up. His opponent's chin held up, but you do not want to be on the receiving end of those types of strikes. Lands a glancing right hand upstairs. Pretty good right hand. Oh, man, I think you jumped out of your seat a little bit after that kick. Oh, I did, because I have time grabbing kick like that. And I'm going to tell you one thing, it does not feel good. All right, next round is now underway. DC, any major takeaways after the previous five minutes? That both of these guys are very evenly matched. The matchmakers did a fantastic job when they put these two in the octagon. Even though it wasn't crazy, you got to see high-level mixed martial arts. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Looked like he might have landed there. Instead, a swing and a miss by Lee. Punch coming, it's blocked. Ooh, what a punch. Real sneaky head kick gets in there. Misses again with a right punch. He has a commitment to kicking the right and it shows. And he caught the kick. Oh, and he got tagged by that combination. Oh! Oh, straight right! Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Pressure, pressure, pressure. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Nice body kick right under the elbow. Oh, nice kick right there. Tell the masses how, how good that feels to get kicked like that. Johnny doesn't. It doesn't feel good to be kicked like that. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Lee gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. That was a thudding leg kick. Yeah, he's mixing it all up. Nice head kick. Oh, and he lands yet another strike to the body. Pinpoint placement right underneath the elbow. Lee gets crushed with that hook. Look at the turtle in that kick. Punch is blocked. Oh, and he caught the kick. Just missed with the left there. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Big right hook coming, it's blocked. Oh man, this guy kicks like a mule. So hard, he kicks so hard every time you see him drive his shin into his opponent. Oh, oh, slams and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. And he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by Lee. Well, he is really starting to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Not as much offense earlier in the fight. He is making up for lost time now. The low kick is there. Go! 
Oh, he's got it going now. Nice connection there, DC. Another punch land. Well, looks as though his leg is hurt here. You can even see him limping a little bit. Blocks the shot. Well done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Lee going with the kick to the body, but unable to find the range. Big kick land. Well, he misses with the left punch there. Look at a warfare at trying to shut the liver down. Oh, strong punch there by Lee. Body kick land right under the elbow. Oh, Roundhouse, talk to me about that kick. He is throwing his entire body into that kick to the point that he turns all the way around before he can face his opponent again. Beautiful strike. Body All right, so an entertaining five minutes. Let's look back at some of the highlights, DC, and I'd imagine a lot of these replays are going to be rooted in that kicking game that was on full display. Absolutely. You're going to see a lot of different techniques, but the kicking was the key to him getting ahead in this fight. He's out ahead now. He needs to stay the course and continue to do that as the fight goes on. All right, so after he landed a high number of kicks in the previous round, we'll see if he can keep it going here as our next round gets underway. He should stay the course. He's so educated with his legs and his feet. Kick home, and now his opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it. He was high, and now he's got him hurt bad. Big kick lands. The right hook to the body. Just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Continuing to work the body to great effect. Looks like his leg is hurt here. You can even see him limping a little bit. Hands up. Hands up. Big body kick lands. Under three minutes now to go in the round. Pinpoint accuracy on that kick. No wind up, no tell, just a brutal kick. Well, you gotta think he's happy with this performance here tonight. Essentially, just the way he drew it up, it's been a striking point. It's like a fairy tale. He's doing everything he wanted to do, and his opponent isn't doing much to try and deter him and really mess with the game plan. That's a big strike right there. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Lee gets hit with a kick. Oh, that right hand is on point. Yeah. Oh, How 
Plus, his opponent still stands. I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. able to find that precise range with the high kick. Big leg kick land. Nice. Trying to go to the body here, unable to find the target. Lands with the right hand. See how he responds. Real quick leg kick. Unable to connect with the right hand. Good punch. Lee's kick is blocked. Oh, pinpoint knee to the body. If you're trying to knock me out, you put one knee to the body, I'm done. Every time an opponent tries to get close, he just drives that knee to the body. Great timing. Trying to do damage now with the ball. Oh, lands up the and lands crushed to the If they land perfect, that is the reaction you're hoping to get. That one landed perfect. That's right. They can stop very soon. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. 20 minutes down, potentially five to go. All right, there's the end of the round. We'll show you some of the highlights. It must feel pretty damn good to knock a man down like that. It feels good to knock a man down. And most times, you don't even feel it. It's the ones that you don't even recognize that landed hard are the ones that usually put your opponent out. It landed right on the sweet spot, and he hurt his opponent very badly. Are you ready? You ready? We have arrived at this fifth and final round. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. there with a punch, so pretty good striking display by him thus far. He throws everything so straight and so accurate. He does everything so well, and he's so calm. He's so calm in the face of such a big spot. Right hook to the head block. He's looking to land the right just out of range. Very tricky when he throws that body kick. Beautiful jab by him there. Got that to the target quickly. He's dictating the fight with a jab. Oh, bone on bone, shin slash foot, right to the skull. You see why I'm a commentator and not a fighter? You see why? Yeah, those are fun. I'm telling you, man, you get kicked in the head a lot of times at the end of the night. You got a little experience with that. Yes, huh? I do. A little bit. Horrible. All right, so a knockdown for him in the previous round, and you can just see by his body language how confident he is in the striking realm in this matchup. And you can see his confidence in his posture, but also you can see the effect that knockdown had on his opponent by the way he is approaching this round. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Yeah, he's mixing it all up. Oh, nice job with the knee strike there. That'll wake you up. He thought it would be available. He just knew he had to find the right time to throw it. That was the right time. Two, three, two. Three minutes now to go in this one. Nice. Well, that body kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. Timely defense there, huge block for him. Get those combinations those hands. 
Oh, and he lands another punch there. And you can tell at this point, he is going right at that cut on his opponent. Right at the cut on the eye, just making sure he knows that I'm going to be targeting it. Keep your hands up, and when the hands go up, he will then change the target down low, trying to find finish. Trying to establish that jab once again. Look at the force behind that leg kick. All right, it's late in the fight now. I don't need to be a judge to tell you that he is clearly losing. What is a fighter's mentality when you know you need a finish or you're getting an L? This is when you got to go to the Nate Diaz mentality. Kill or be killed. You got to throw everything at your opponent because if this thing goes to the judges, you are not going to win this fight. Bring it down. Big and kick. Good sequence of kicks there by Lee. Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. Lee gets stung by that leg kick. Ball left hook to the head. It's blocked. Great punch landing with so much power. Oh, nice. Ball right, then a left. Outstanding kick there by Lee. There's the kick, it's blocked. One minute to go in the fight. Lee gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. Oh, combination lands. You want to talk about putting strikes together. Beautiful execution. There. And every one of them are landing. He's overwhelming him with different attacks. Good series of strikes for him there, staying busy and staying accurate. I mean, the accuracy is unbelievable. Oh, nice right hand, John. Nice combination of kicks there by Lee. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Right under the elbow, the body kick lands. 15 seconds. Way to hide that leg kick. Big punch land. Top and now his opponent in a world of trouble. Beautiful level change. Make him think you're going low in the top. Right over the top with that beautiful overhand. Great punch. What else can you say but what a fight. All right, so as we await the judges' scorecards, DC will look back at his handiwork. He had it all going from a striking standpoint tonight. Man, he did a great job. It was very entertaining to watch someone be in such a great state of flow, a great flow state in regards to the stand-up. He said that tonight would be very impressed with his performance, and I am thoroughly impressed.